Um, my name is Julie Hollis. I'm the Secretary General of Eurogea Surveys, and this is the first training that I have been involved in, and it's a great pleasure to be here. Uh, what I want to start by doing is having some introductions from everyone who hasn't yet uh, introduced themselves. Uh, first of all, I'll start with your trainers for today. Uh, there are five of, five of us, one, two, three, four, five, I think, yes. Um, so, uh, let me see. David, would you like to introduce yourself? I'll uh, just bring a... Thank you very much. Dr. Hi, good morning, everybody. Um, David Koza from the Council for Geoscience. It's very good to see all of you here and look forward to an excellent day. Thank you. Thank you, David. Krishnan. Uh, good morning, everyone. My name is Krishnan. I get most of you we met yesterday. Uh, so good to see you. Uh, I'm working at Eurasia Service as a communications officer. So we'll be discussing a lot today. Looking forward to the discussions. Morning, everyone. Uh, my name is Andibu Osisliya Mugosi. I'm a scientist at the Council for Geoscience. Thank you. And um, if you just pass it to uh, Celine as well. But before uh, Celine uh, uh, mentions, uh, introduces herself, I also want to introduce another trainer, Heather Handley. She is not here, but she has delivered a uh, video, short video training on uh, film, which you'll see later today. Celine? Yes, so my name is uh, Celine, but also Mama Celine. <laughs> Welcome, everyone. I'm, I'm very, very happy. It's the first uh, training communication, so it's a very special day for all of us. Um, I'm a director of the Secretariat of Eurojust Surveys in Brussels, and I'm also in charge of the Panavjo project within ETS. Voilà. Bienvenue, carrez-vous. Wonderful, thank you. And I'll just bring it back down here and we can, uh, we can pass around the room for people who haven't yet introduced themselves. And once we get to our trainees, I'd like you to tell us your name, where you're from, and uh, very briefly, your interest in science communication. Frank. Uh, thank you so much. My name is uh, Frank Mujenyi. Uh, I'm an African from Uganda. Uh, I'm a member of the uh, Panaf Geo, member of advisory board, uh, and I've worked with African Union. I've been member of the advisory board uh, from Panaf Geo One, Two, and I'm hoping to be still there for Panaf Geo Three. So, good morning, everyone. I'm Nicolas Char from French Geological Survey. I'm the deputy coordinator of uh, Panaf Geo with Jean Claude, and I'm a pure geologist, field work, mapping, structural geology, and that's true that geologists were very bad in communication. When we speak with someone, every, every, uh, if we have two geologists on outcrop, there is two explanations. And when you speak about geology, about uh, public, etc., they understand nothing. That's right. But that's very difficult, and we have to learn about it, to use the correct word, to use the correct uh, media, etc., etc. So I think we will see that all the day. Thank you. Good morning. My name is Arthur Cooper from the Liberian Geological Survey. I'm an exploration geologist there. Uh, we, we do regional mapping actually, and compliance monitoring for mining companies across the country. So I'm excited to be here and open to learn new things. Thank you. Thank you. Good morning. Um, my name is Martha Haludelu from the Geological Survey of Namibia. I'm an information practitioner no geological background. Um, here I'm just to learn more about uh, geoscience communication and how I can better improve because I deal with a lot of geologists and scientists so I would like to learn more. Morning everyone. Uh, my name is Kwesha Chinaka from Zambia. I work for the Geological Survey of Zambia. I'm, I'm an exploration geologist under regional mapping. So this training is going to help me when we go out uh, mapping. We have a lot of community engagement and we also sell out uh, geological maps to the general public. So this training will be very profound. Good morning, everyone. I'm Olivia Nimsima. I'm from Geological Survey and Mines in Uganda. I'm IT administrator. I deal with their communication, but like everyone said, that science do a lot and they talk so little. So they will go in the field, do so much, bring back like two photos. And uh, 
and they have seen a lot, they have done a lot, so you, you have so little to put out there for people who do not know a lot about science to deal with. So I hope from this training I can get information to help them how they can communicate better because they, they really do a lot. Good morning, everyone. I'm Josephus Hussein Abdullah from the Sierra Leone Geological Surveys. Um, I'm a field geologist. <laughs> Initially, I never thought geologists need any training in communication. So when I saw the, 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 the advertisement on Panavgeo, I was so excited to, to apply. So I, I hope I will learn something new that I will use in my next work. Morning, everyone. My name is Josephine Ushona. I'm from the Geological Survey of Namibia. I'm a senior geoscientist, but I'm involved in a lot of outreach program and um, public engagement. I do agree when geologists go in the field, they only bring back two pictures, and it's of a rock and a hammer. <laughs> so <laughs> my work uh, is also to d dis disseminate geological information, so that makes it difficult for me to communicate with the, with, the, with the community. But I would like to learn a lot. Uh, that's why I am here attending this program. Good morning, everyone. I'm Carol Zemi from the French Geological Survey. I'm also from a geoscience background, so I'm not that good in communication, and I have to improve this. Uh, um, I'm the project manager of Africa Maval, which is a Pan-African project as well, which started last year. Uh, and we do have um, a work package dedicated to communication, dissemination, and dialogue. So we need to improve on this part, and um, I'm looking forward to getting more information on this this, uh, this day. Thank you. Um, good morning, everyone. My name is Mashati Mononela, and I'm a manager for communications and stakeholder relations at the Council for Geoscience. Um, I'm here to just uh, see what the course contents are about and the training and just to sort of compare where we are because our organizational strategy is primarily driven by communications and stakeholder relations. Thank you. Morning everyone. My name is Farah Zuluni. I'm at the Council for Geoscience and OHS. This training program will be very useful, especially now that the OHS has moved to another level. Communication becomes very key. So I do not have science background, but I believe I'm a scientist at heart now. <laughs> Hello everyone, my name is Yasmin Fortune. I am a geologist at the Council for Geoscience, and I have been following the uprising of science communication for the last two years in a personal capacity. So I'm really interested in how I can disseminate scientific information the right way, because as you've heard, geologists struggle with communication um, so I'm very excited to be here and to learn from all of you. Thank you. Hi, good morning, everyone. Uh, my name is Mbuise Ningobo. Uh, I'm with the Council for Geoscience. Uh, also, from my side, um, I'm, well, I'm, I'm a geologist by prior learning. <laughs> no, I'm not a scientist at all, but I'm just learning. Uh, so my interest uh, is really just to learn from everyone and see how we can help to just uh, move jargon away from how we communicate to the communities. Thank you. Uh, good morning, everyone. Uh, I'm Shamin Sakiwo uh, from the Geological Survey of uh, Eswatini, formerly known as uh, Swaziland. Uh, I have uh, much interest in uh, environmental uh, geology. Uh, I believe no one has the intention to degrade the environment. It's just that uh, the information is not well disseminated. So I believe in this training, I'm going to and get enough uh, knowledge. Uh, unfortunately, I believe uh, the timing is very short. Uh, maybe next time it will be a bit longer because I believe you can help us a lot. Uh, it is very true that we are not able to communicate, to communicate with uh, our politicians uh, who are responsible for financing our project, communicating with uh, the communities that we work with, uh, the media. They end up uh, writing stories that are not well informed because we, are, we cannot communicate uh, our findings. So I believe uh, I'm going to get a lot uh, out of uh, this training. Thank you. Good morning, everyone. My name is Hafizu Mohamed Su. 
I'm from the, Repo- the, the Republic of Liberia, from the Liberian Geological Survey. And uh, it's a great pleasure to be here. And uh, it's an open secret that uh, scientists are poor communicators, verbally and through writing. When we write, we use a lot of jargons that people that, that, that the layman don't understand. So I believe from this training, we'll be able to bridge a gap between a scientist and non-scientist. Thank you very much. Good morning, uh, everyone. Uh, I'm Thomas Mwedi from Council for Your Sciences. Uh, I'm also a, a, a scientist uh, by profession. I'm a geologist. I'm more interested on the uh, communication as well. Um, I've also seen that uh, the communication that we have with us, with scientists, and the communication that we have with, uh, with the public should be maybe refined because the public doesn't understand us when we communicate, but we understand each other. So I'm more interested in learning or bridging that gap between the communities with our scientists. Thank you. Good morning, everyone. My name is Mary, and I'm from the Ghana Geological Survey. Um, I'm a geologist and a business development officer. The business development unit is a new unit of the authority, so um, we interact a lot with clients and explain our services and everything to them. So this training is actually going to help me to also teach the others to help um, break down um, scientific, um, geoscientific issues to the public and the clients. Thank you. Uh, morning, everyone. I'm John Toon Omondi from uh, Geological Survey of Kenya, an exploration geophysicist. And uh, I'm also excited about this training. As, uh, it has been well documented that uh, as scientists, uh, communication is not one of our strengths. So, from this training, I'm really looking forward to uh, developing that skill and, uh, uh, and be able to communicate well. Uh, <clears throat> as an example, in our country, Kenya, it has become an issue uh, to really get funding to do geological work. Uh, it has become sort of a, 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 a bottleneck that you put in projects, but uh, the feedback that comes from the decision makers, including the permanent secretaries and the CSOs, uh, the project proposals usually end up not passing or not getting any funding. So I think uh, the training on communication and how better to package our, uh, our scientific proposals will be very much beneficial. Good morning, everyone. My name is George Guda from Kenya Geological Survey. I'm a geologist and I'm also a geoinformation manager with the Geological Survey of Kenya. So with this training, I look forward to sharpening my skills in geoinformation management to be able to communicate and uh, uh, disseminate uh, geoinformation in a better and a more organized way to different audiences. Uh, I'm excited to be here, and I look forward to a uh, uh, fruitful training. Thank you. I'm Natfanta from Ethiopia. I work for the Mineral, Stock, uh, Mineral Development Institute. Today, I expect that uh, how we easily communicate the geoscience data information to the public, and as my friend from Kenya said, how easily communicate the financer. The, because of most of our proposal is the geological uh, language. So how can easily the financer uh, understand the geology without uh, passing or understanding the, the development of uh, the geology? Uh, and most of the time when we propose or when we propose the mineral development, um, they don't look even the the document. So we want a financer. The, the, when I say the financer, the financer from the government. So I 
I expect today to hear uh, the, how we communicate uh, the public, both the public and the citizens and the government to understand the geological issue. Thank you. Hi guys. I'm Mr. Kumete from the Council, I'm from the Geological Survey at, in, in the Kingdom of Eswatini. I'm a specialist in GIS, remote sensing and database management. And um, my tasks are similar to yours, George, um, where I'm geo, um, my designation is geo information officer. So yeah, we're well, busy with that. Investors come to my office with various theories and <laughs> Yeah, my, my job is just to clear those off and um, to give them the right information which will be pertinent to the, the projects that they're trying to run. So looking forward to this uh, program. Um, hopefully we'll come out um, better equipped with um, communication skills. So thank you. Good morning all. My name is Jasper Donker. I'm from the Geological Survey of the Netherlands. It's a pleasure to meeting you all here. Uh, we are uh, in charge of the work package governance. Uh, a little bit has been explained before already, and I think the relationship between governance and communication has been really made clearly by the words of uh, Mr. Moza Mombasa about how the importance is of developing a compelling story towards your government, towards society, and towards other stakeholders. So that's something we will continue also in our work package to work on. Um, I'm not a geologist by background, I'm an energy and climate uh, researcher, uh, but that doesn't mean I'm a good communicator as well. So hopefully I can learn also myself something more about that. Okay, thank you very much everybody for introducing yourself.